geckos balls are swollen. I don't know if you guys can see that, but those are abnormally sized hemipenes. I had the honor of seeing Lissa's lizard's first ever reptile, Charlie the leopard gecko, for impacted hemipenes. Although this can happen due to improper husbandry, it can also happen with older male leopard geckos who aren't able to clean themselves as well. This was the case with Charlie as he is around 14 years old and Alyssa's husbandry is spot on. Luckily, Alyssa noticed the swelling and brought him to me before it had progressed too far. We gave him some injectable pain medication and sedation so that he wouldn't experience any pain and drop his tail when I was cleaning out his hemipenes. We monitor his heart rate throughout the whole procedure with a device called a Doppler. Many reptiles, including leopard geckos, actually have two hemipenes. They do not urinate out of them as they are used purely for mating. Over time, something called smegma or debris made out of sperm and dead skin cells can accumulate. Only his right hemipene was impacted as you can see the difference between the right and left sides. As expected, he still had some residual swelling, so we prescribed an anti-inflammatory called meloxicam for the next few days. As it was a relatively simple and clean procedure with no incisions or bleeding, I didn't feel like antibiotics were necessary in this case. Remember not to try this at home as it can lead to pain, dropped tail, prolapse, and infection depending on the severity. And here he is awake but a little bit drunk and feeling much better.